Good morning, you guys. So we survived Hurricane Milton. <laughs> it was a scary one. It was a rough one. It was a tough oh one. But by the grace of God, we made it and we're good. We're well. Uh, just wanted to come on here and update everyone who was concerned because there was a lot of concerned people. We do not have service right now. We're we're not able to send out texts or, or post anything or post nothing. anything. So. Um, look crazy. Yeah, about to probably drive out and see if we could find some better reception somewhere, and so we could reach out to our family, probably check if on we our could family. Could drive out because the roads are blocked. Literally, yeah. we're gonna show y'all. I don't know if they moved it already, but there's trees down everywhere. Yeah, we went to sleep at like three o'clock in the morning, mm -hmm. two o'clock in the morning, something like that. It's nine a.m. It's very hot inside our house because we've been without power since around ten thirty, eleven last night. So. Yeah, but it feels so good outside. Like this is the yeah, coolest. Yeah, we could just be outside. This honestly, is the coolest bro. it's felt outside in so long. Roof shingles came off. There's trees down everywhere. I'm shocked that our lanai is still standing. So I just got done talking to our neighbor. They're Florida natives, and even he was like, "Bro, this is bad. This is the worst you know we've ever seen it." And it was just, it was just really bad, man. It was, it was pretty freaking bad. He said they haven't had a direct hit in a hundred years, so. It was, you know, long overdue, mm -hmm. <laughs> unfortunately. Uh, but yeah, if you guys do not follow us on Snapchat, you guys missed out on so much freaking content, bro. All of the preparation leading up to this point, everything that we did to, you know, stay afloat inside the house, like late at night when all yeah. of the power went off. I had to cook my freaking <laughs> sandwich on candles. <laughs> So all of that was documented and posted on Snapchat. That's literally where we did everything. So we weren't we weren't posting on Instagram, we weren't posting on YouTube, we weren't posting nowhere about this hurricane, but Snapchat, you guys are finally getting the update here right now, but in real time Snapchat, follow our Snapchats, everything will be on the screen. I'll just leave that there for you guys because if you you, you aren't following us on Snapchat, you're just missing out on our entire life, honestly. <laughs> I look crazy! Oh my god, I can't even on camera but like this. <laughs> let's go on a little tour. Leading up to the storm, we moved all of our patio stuff here. These uh, are so dirty because of so how much dirty. it's been raining. Yeah, like yeah. we probably have to throw those out and get new ones. Even after the storm, we realized like how dirty our patio was. Yeah. So, like especially like under where our fireplace and everything was. But speaking of fireplace, moved all that over here. With the water holes, I uh, caulked up the doors. It's really freaking messy. We put duct tape, we put the sealant. It actually worked because there was water coming in last night. I noticed it was like wet inside our house. Um, so I feel like that really helped. Yeah, but all of this is gonna, you know, come up. I'll be able to get all this up later. Okay, y'all, so boom. That's the big damage back here. Thankfully, um, our lanai is still intact. Nothing really much happened over here, but this, oh my god, this is our neighbor's tree. It snapped right there and fell over, and what's crazy is we heard when this happened last night. It was probably like 1, 2 in the morning, and I already knew like something had fell over here. We forgot to move all of this, bro. This is acid. <gasps> Baby! That's acid for the pool. Hey, it's two, is it two branches? Yeah. Yeah. You wanna go through it, see if we can find some mangoes? <laughs> I'm surprised oh, this whole tree didn't fall onto <laughs> our freaking house. Don't step on the Yeah, we had shingles flying around everywhere. <laughs> What'd you say, baby? It's said from our roof. I can't believe it. Like, bro, our roof was coming apart. We should have got that trim before. Our palm tree's still standing, bro. This was swinging. This was wind. swinging so I thought it was bad. Oh, bush. damn. A big piece of our roof right here. Yeah, we'll here. cook. Oh my god. This car is crazy. Good. Crazy. It feels so good out here though. What the hell? Thank god this tree didn't fall down. That came up. That's like uprooted, babe. Don't. You're gonna get splinters. Oh my gosh. Babe. <laughs> this big old tree. Yeah, heavy, huh? Not him trying to move this big old tree. Oh my god. I'm trying to move trees. I'm trying to get some trees up the road. Trying to do something good for the community. I'm trying to be a good Samaritan. 
This shit was crazy. Tampa was definitely humbled, unfortunately. Um, and I'm just glad we're safe. Hope my family's safe. I haven't been able to hear from them or shoot out a text. So, uh, about to probably head over there and just see if everybody's doing good. Uh, hope, you know, if you're in Tampa, hope everybody in Tampa was safe. Just happy we made it through the storm. We just ran through the neighborhood. Everybody's out here trying to clean up the uh, little, oh, the little kid. <laughs> <gasps> their fence. Glad to see people out and doing well. Sheesh. Okay. At least nobody's glass broke. I was gonna say I'm so happy for the Florida like regulations. Look at like all the these building bridges. laws. Bro, that's wild. <gasps> it's split in half. I'm happy to see nature doing what it gotta do on these on all these trees that's out here because Babe. Bro, <laughs> he a tree whole, hater. No, our whole area is like Be oh careful my these God, people. like overwhelmingly overbuilt with trees. Tree fell onto their truck. Damn bro. Damn. Oh my <gasps> Oh my god. Oh, I guess he wasn't playing. That tree is literally blocking the entire road. Oh my look at the grass. It like do you see that? Yeah. How it uprooted from the grass? Crazy. <gasps> That's crazy. Nelly just sitting outside. There's a squirrel it. right there. This is blocking the entire road. Wow. Oh, this side too. Is there oh any? Oh my god. Oh. One thing I am grateful for is how this whole area is built, like with the sewer systems. It is crazy. Crazy. You finna drive through it? I gotta, baby, I gotta go around it. <laughs> oh my god. <gasps> oh my god, y'all. That's insane. This is like down the street from our house. Oh my god, no, that ginormous tree fell down. Y'all, literally, my phone has been a dot 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 since yesterday. Like, I have no signal it says that she sent this at 7 57 a.m but i literally just got in well we're at we didn't even get the worst of the storm bro you just hear ambulances everywhere y'all look at the sonic look at their whole sign down that's Sonic. crazy. Sonic too. The sound of that tree was wild, bro. I thought I knew a tree fell and hit our fence. Yeah. I but I didn't it know too. it was our neighbor's tree. I thought maybe it was one of the trees like the behind back. the fence. Yeah. Yeah. I knew it as soon as we heard that sound. And luckily with the like Florida building regulations, like these houses are built to withstand like these kind of storms. So. Yeah, even though a few of our roof shingles came off, but Yeah, but that's like the bare minimum. Thank God we made it through. I'm just praying for everybody else who wasn't as fortunate, who had like extreme damage. Cause I know there's people in Florida who who had extreme damage. So I'm just praying for everybody, praying that everybody was safe. It's completely flooded over here. Like the water is up to the tires. Yeah, I don't know if I should go through this, baby. I ain't even allowed to. Don't drive through this. This water is so deep, y'all. Like. Look at this. That's where the curb is. It's over the curb. I wouldn't risk it, baby, because what if we can't get back home? This is crazy. We're literally like, look how deep the water is. It's because they have lakes, like all, not lakes, but is it a lake? Like little ponds, mm -hmm. little lake areas in these apartments. Those people just standing there. Look at this. All right, y'all, so this camera is 1%, so I got to hurry up, but um, I managed to get the trees out of here. No, no gear. I don't got gloves, no protective gear, nothing. Just straight macho, just straight masculine energy. The whole tree up here, I had to take all that shit from the back, bro, by myself. That's crazy. So that's pretty much the least of our worries at this point. We're going to close this vlog out here. Oh, like a bum. We're <laughs> back home. We're chilling. As I showed you guys, I just... Cleaned up the tree and everything, took it up front. So I just hopped out the shower. I had to wash my hair because I had ants and tree sap all on my body and in my hair, bruh.
My hands are literally in so much pain. I should have wore gloves. I ain't gonna lie. I told you. <laughs> but yeah, we just wanted to hop on here and give you guys a quick update because we have been updating, you know, our Snapchat nonstop. We gave Instagram a few updates. So we just wanted to, you know, come on here and fill you guys in. Thank you to all of you guys who, you know, was concerned and reaching out and commenting on videos and just messaging us. Uh, wishing us well so we appreciate you guys we love you guys so much and uh yeah we'll see you guys next time we love y'all